Animal Inside Out, it is a unique opportunity to take a glimpse into Mother Nature. It's a very unusual view that you get on particular animals that unveil all their body interior. You see all the muscles, nerves and organs that are inside these creatures, but also inside us, because we also have a few human specimens on display. And you will easily understand and see how wonderful nature is and how much we share in common. I think we're fascinated by things that we don't actually see every day. So we see each other, we see humans, we see people every day, but getting to see under the skin uh, in a very real sense, uh, I think is very exciting because it's not something we, we ever do. We know it's there, but we never really stop and appreciate it. Especially with our relationship with animals as well, especially with the dog when you walk in and you're seeing something that you probably see every day, that's part of your family. And then to see it kind of deconstructed like that, it's phenomenal. And then huge animals that you'd never come close to. Yeah, take your breath away. It's really visual, so when you come in and obviously you see these amazing animals, it's pretty jaw-dropping. And then as you read the information as you go around, there's a lot of levels and a lot of depth to it. I think the giraffe is just massive, at times a hundred, and I was just very impressed by the size of the bull's heart. I think the best thing about the exhibition was looking at the nervous systems of all the animals. I just like looking at the way that they spread across the whole body, like, and it's not what you'd expect. It is very essential to us that the exhibit leaves a very positive feeling with any of our visitors. It's all designed, the purpose of it is to promote respect for the animal kingdom and uh, witnessing the species in, in all their glory like this really kind of hits home how we interact with them and how we treat them and can affect them and affect us. It's very essential that the specimens look beautiful in a very dramatic and aesthetic way that you find it easy to look at, learn from it and are happy to remember that. You know, we all struggle on a daily basis with bringing the kind of science to life and I think this does it perfectly. I think it's a fantastic option and it's great that we've got somewhere like the Centre for Life where we can bring students and expose them to things that you just wouldn't see in everyday life. Life and nature is such a great treasure and what I would hope for Newcastle is that people are fascinated and gain a sense of appreciation and don't get it for granted. Life is short, life is something very valuable and it is our responsibility to maintain that.